Hey, what's up out there, techers? Elric Ferris here, once again, the Tech of Tomorrow channel, bringing you guys the unboxing and first look at the new Fortress 750 watt power supply from the people over at Rosewill. It's supposed to be a semi modular power supply, it's supposed to support SLI and Crossfire and all that other good shiznick. So, beyond that, let's jump in and let's see what comes inside this little box. All right, folks, like every good unboxing, obviously we're gonna show you the box. It's the Fortress Series, 750 watt, 80 plus platinum, which is as high as you can get. Seven year warranty, that's pretty incredible. You guys can see it in the front. Here's the back, I'll have the cameraman zoom in. It tells you the different features. Actually, little feature screens right here. ATX 12 volt, 80 plus platinum, full range active PFC. Silent 135 millimeter fan with auto speed control, all high quality Japanese capacitors, all this good stuff over this, over that, over that, over that, all kinds of over protection. Seven year warranty, one to one replacement, which means this thing gets messed up. You call the folks up, get an RMA, you can get an advanced RMA and get your power supply. So that said, let's go ahead and let's cut this open. Now, this is a dual rail power supply. Some are single rail. This is a dual rail. Again, we'll take the paper and put the cameraman on the camera. There's a little clip right here in the back. So we're gonna go ahead and just knock that off. Pop the box open. The cap comes off. Kaboom, 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 as I go all crazy here. Get the Fortress 80 plus platinum. It's your manual. All that good stuff. Zip ties for cable management. foam to hold the thing in place or to throw a cameraman like so. Power supply cable. Get this thing out of here. Another foamy thing for the cameraman. The mounting screws. Throw them at the cameraman. Oh no! I just like throwing stuff at the cameraman today. I don't know why. It's one of those days. He's angered me. That's right. Cameramen do that. They have that effect on us. Alright. So get the box out of the way. Kaboom. So let's start dissecting the unit. First off, let's take a look at all of the cabling. So actually folks, I guess I read the box wrong. This power supply isn't modular at all. It's completely connected, no modular at all. So that was my bad on the intro there. Here's that 135 millimeter silent fan we talked about. They said it's adjustable as well. The Fortress. Series nomenclature. Flip it around. Here's the back side. You can see the AC input, the DC output, the total power. Once again, they're saying it's 80 plus platinum. High pot okay, burn in okay, ATS okay, so it passed all of their tests. Here's the back shot. You can kind of see inside of there some of the parts that they're using. Power plug in, on and off switch. And uh, all right, that's pretty much that. Now let's just go over all of the different cabling now. So let's start off, get this stuff all apart here one by one. So here is power. 24 pin power right there. Try to dig all these things out and separate them by power in that. But they're all just kind of in a giant conglomerate mess here. Believe it or not, can be kind of frustrating when you're even trying to show it to you in the video as I try to go through and figure the, all the power plugs out. Okay. Here goes some additional power. Eight pin, four plus four. So these are all your power connectors right here. I'm trying to separate those. These are your power. Okay. I'll try to bring these things all out one by one. It's Frustrating as I'll get up, I'll tell you that. All right, here go our SATA. Get that out of the way. Next up, another SATA. Go ahead and just try to get these ones out of the way. Video card, six and eight pin. Once again, we have another video card. One, two, six to eight pins, so you know it'll support SLI or Crossfire configurations. It'll support two video cards, no more than that. Continue on, Molex, 
And finally, another Molex and your floppy drive connector for those of you who use old school stuff. So, all right, folks, so here it is, the Rosewell Fortress 750 watt power supply. If you're interested in buying this thing, you guys can look at the link in the description below and purchase this thing for yourself. We're gonna throw it on a test bed and see how it does and get back to you a little bit later and just tell you a little bit more about this Fortress 750 watt power supply. So peace out.